Welcome everyone to part two of three of the exciting Scavenger Zeeb's hunt. The quest for more items. I'm still cracking. The power bomb man. strikes back. <laughs> it does. And you're getting shot by this lightning. Yeah, those things are really annoying. Actually, they're even more annoying than in Super Metroid. Actually, because I, I don't like. They need like you need a super missile to kill them, and your regular shots even don't work, and that's really annoying. I don't know, I always found the Black Pirates here a lot more annoying, because they're generally way, 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 way harder to kill. Oh yeah, that's why I'm avoiding them. So yeah, it's sissy. so if you remember from Super Metroid, the uh, the whole trick with Meridia for breaking the glass tunnel, well, it does it here too. You don't get any immediate feedback because you have to leave it the place and then come back. But that's kind of annoying because you might think, oh, it doesn't work and not bother to come back, but it does. Look at those space parts, they think they're so slick. Oh yeah. They're not good enough though for the Shine Spark. Not at all. You could say they were already dead. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> what? Fist of the North Star, oh, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Yep. So? Yeah. That's a good... It's a very interesting Ooh. show. Yeah, yeah it's not some... little. There's some foreshadowing there. I wonder what those uh, speed blocks are going to be used for. Oh boy, I wonder. Mm, there's a bit of these uh, sloped ledges. Oh, not ledges, but sloped floors. Mm, mm. Yeah. I, oh yeah, there is a funny thing about this too. Um, for some reason, while you're shine sparking, enemies can still hit you. So if one of those green ball things <laughs> hit you, they can hit you while shine sparking and that will screw it up and you have to do it over. That is really fucking annoying. And I hate that's I think I remember that's, that's awesome. <laughs> I think I just remember clearing out the previous the other room like entirely and just running through there that's, and just having most the the, the shine spark up. That's probably the safest way to do it. But I, I decided to be daring and it did work this time. What's this? I don't know. There's oh god, gamer zoomer things hiding in here. Is their name Gamers? Um, I think so. Yeah. Yeah, it sounds right. Nintendo has like the weirdest names for enemies. It's Metro. It's they're Metroid monsters. They don't. It doesn't really matter. But that's just what they're called. There's a little bit of information there. Well, all of the ships in Ikaruga have a name too. So I guess whatever. Mm. Do people? Yeah, I never bothered learning names in most of these games. Like, oh. It's like, I'm going to fight the dude who is flexing at me. <laughs> oh, wait, we're not playing, uh, we're not playing Toaniki, damn. Nice mustard! <laughs> I was thinking of Gunstar Heroes for a second, which I actually did play through lately. That's a pretty, really good game. Yeah, Gunstar Heroes is great. It is a fun game. Fun yep. Game. Very <laughs> simple names. Exactly. For people. Okay, right, we're perfect. finally out of, uh... The space pirate ship, and I completely and Krakon is into uh, totally into ball sparking. Oh, oh yeah! <laughs> In the Metroid context, guys, God, God. <laughs> yes. I'm ball sparking so, now. You don't have to. You don't have to be all embarrassed, Krakon. There's nothing wrong with uh -huh. it. You know what a man does in his spare time is, you know. <laughs> so yes, I showed off the. You need the power bombs here. And there is a good reason for that, because if they weren't there, you'll see how you could break the game, possibly, early on. Something I'll have to try with the game, game Shark code or something. Wait, break a game early on? Yeah, because you, you... Yeah, you could possibly go past here. You could go through Turian in reverse, and I don't know what the heck would happen. Actually, that's a good question. What would happen? See, there's case? actually... Yes. So, um, exercise for the viewer, I guess. See what happens. Report back to the thread. Also, make sure that your picture gets hotlinked from somewhere else that replaces the image with the goat. See whenever your bandwidth gets taken away. <laughs> Very good suggestion. Hey, yeah, that's a great idea. <laughs> I'm gonna write that down on my to-do list. Excellent. You're gonna do it for Grand Pain, aren't you? So whenever I post a picture, it's gonna be like, oh hey, a bunch of people click stuff <laughs> in this thread. I'm gonna fuck with, I'm gonna fuck with Garen's account. Oh. Yeah, oh. anytime something gets linked from your directory, it's just going to replace it with Lemon yeah. Party. So a bunch of Damn Super man. Metroid item things, item uh, collection spots lately. This one is not, though. 
In fact, this is a, another insane item to get, all for a stupid missile. I like this. I like doing this the intended way, though. Yes. I'm assuming it's the intended way, at least. Yeah, this is the easy way, the Shine Spark way. Because the way I think you're intended to do it is you have to continually space jump while being uh, boosted. That's how I do yeah. it. It's fucking fun. It's fun to do, but it's much easier to screw up. And Yeah. Oh, it's very easy to, yeah, to, to just totally screw it up, and then you have to restart the whole thing, but it's so cool when you do it. Here's another question. Um, with that bonus video I showed off like how you could do the early shine spark but there are shine spark uh, no not shine spark speed booster blocks on the left side could you possibly get that missile early on during the escape or is that something that was accounted for I wonder I think that's probably accounted for because I mean when you come back here that door is not sealed normally you know what I mean that's true yeah I have to wonder if they already they already thought of it and they just uh, like replaced the wall yeah because they paid a lot of attention to anything speed boost wise yeah. throughout the entire thing. They paid a lot of attention to a lot of weird, silly things yeah. they didn't even think of. Nintendo way. hires good programmers, so, you know, like, they, they probably thought of a lot of this, and people who have been doing this shit for years, too, so. Well, it's it's also interesting that the, the, the ship itself, like, the, the, the pirate ship and a lot of other little things, there's a lot of little hidden shortcuts in this game, like, almost targeted at speedrunners. Yep. Yeah, this game, it's just this like, game was basically made oh. with, like, Speed, speed running in mind, like you, as you probably be yeah, able to tell. Yeah, so it's kind of interesting. They thought of a lot yeah. of this. So yeah, Craig's Lair. the missing missile packs. I think I have to get. This is a really fun one, one where you you are. I, I love this yeah, dude. You are required to do uh, shine sparky. No ball sparky. I don't know what the. Ball sparking. Whatever it's called. Yeah. Sparky balls. You just you just like sparking your balls. It's alright. It's alright, crack. It's alright. You guys. Oh, like balls. Now you don't necessarily need the space jump to come back here for this one, but I it's it's on the way and it's just a bit easier, so whatever. I always got it right here anyway, just because I never really escaped from the ship when I played. Yep. <laughs> well, I think I, I played once, I streamed it and I beat it, and I was like, sweet I can wall jump. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you missed a lot of really funny things you can do after you get the, uh, after you get all these items identified, yeah. and then you can come come back yeah, here. Yeah, Static, I know you streamed uh, this, and then, well, I watched the stream until you uh, escaped from Zeebs after beating Mother Brain, and then I went to bed. Yeah, and then I hundred percent did. Yeah, then, how long did that take you? Like the? Not terribly. It's it's not hard once you're after you're after you're pretty much done with everything. It's pretty okay. easy. Oh, what yep. the hell? It's oh, yep. it's, it's like one of those little, it's like fusion right Yeah, there. not needed to do, but it's just this stylish thing to do. Yeah, but, no, that's another one of those little neat shortcuts. Yep. Yeah. yeah, fusion had like little yeah, they lots had, of airlocks and everything. Yeah, they had a couple of those yeah, exchanges you, all over the place, which I think you, do, well, do you need yeah. to go through them, the 100% that game? I think so. Mm -hmm. the, I believe at the very end you do have to use them because if you go to a certain uh, point, um, you're locked out. So I don't know. It, it was it's just easier to like go through all those airlocks before you beat it. You just, you just go through. Um, there's two in every zone. Uh, there's two in every sector. Yeah. Well. And. Yeah. When I. It, it's basically just there to. Uh, it, it's pretty much just there just to you know prevent you from. Well, it's it's prevent just seeing Adam. Just to be. It's it's just kind of there, just to actually it's a nice shortcut after a while. Yeah. Actually. God. Can you, so much. Can, can, can you can you uh, can you can you uh, can you uh, uh, it, can you uh, static? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Wow, you just like shine spark or screw attack to that dude, and he was like, whatever. Look at it. He's like, yeah. Hey, I'm just crawling on this wall. So here. I got to do more show show off in in uh, this. Showing, showing off, off whatever in this place because um, I don't know that I call this part the show off room just because of all the shine sparking you can do yep and the plasma beam owns by the way so that's just a confirmation all right it's okay okay <laughs> <laughs> and we're done part two uh, so that was much more interesting than part one so, and part three, we collect the rest of the items, and 
then we will be on our way to beating the game. See you guys later.